day 33. So, I'm doing another fireside chat, i.e. why I'm outside. Um, it's a cold day here in Austin, but, you know, gotta love the fire. But anyways, so today I got a new range. Uh, the old one broke, um, and I had to replace it. And I'm all excited. I've got this, you know, new piece of equipment, and I want to play with it. I want to cook things. Um... But up until now, pretty much the only thing that I've done with the cooking is uh, eating my six meals, where they're very specifically planned. They are, you know, designed to make sure that I stay okay, right, and that I'm not overdoing it or anything like that. Um, but, you know, I'm starting to think, you know, maybe I want to do a cookout on Friday. Maybe I want to, you know, there's two or three things that I would love to cook. Um, and so now I'm like, I need to make sure I follow packed, but I, one of the hardest things for me that I've ever had is a portioning before I cook and then B after I cook, um, not eating it because, or stopping eating because, you know, when I cook my own food, I'm like, it's in front of me. I made it. I put all this energy in it. Why not eat all that food? Even if it's you know, a ton of, you know, French fries or a really big steak or something like that, right? It's I cooked it or a big bowl of pasta. Um, I cooked it, so I should eat it. And so I think that's going to be a challenge for me this week, but I am going to try to face it. And at least once, um, you know, win the fight against myself. Um, if I just like the, like last week, I'd say I followed pack about 50% of the time when I ate my meals. Um, and so if, you know, I continue to do that with the f food that I eat out and then, um, for the food that I make at home, I do it at least once. Um, I think I'll be happy. So we'll try this and we'll see where it goes.